I don't have the typical answer on why I joined CIA. Admittedly, it wasn't a childhood dream of mine, nor does my college degree align with security. But I was lucky enough to stumble across a security administrator position, which eventually led me to an opportunity as a polygraph examiner within CIA's Office of Security. I'm now part of the Director's Protective Staff, which provides armed security to principals under both CIA and the Office of the Director of National Intelligence. We've had several principals that were women, some of whom have asked why there aren't any more women on the Director's Protective Staff. I've been able to inspire not only women to pursue DPS, but also people who wouldn't normally consider themselves qualified to be a special agent. The truth is, I haven't learned how to find a balance between my work and personal life. My husband and I have tested the limits to this balancing act as full-time working parents to two young boys. DPS agents work 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We travel the world and we are unquestionably willing to put our lives at risk for the safety of another person for the greater purpose of national security. I am now a supervisory special agent held by only a handful of women in the past. I've experienced highs and lows both professionally and personally, but I've learned that open and honest communication are undoubtedly the most important factors that allowed for my truly amazing experiences.